Great Scott, everybody! Welcome back to Let's Play Crash Bandicoot Warped. In this stage, we're gonna go back to the future. In other words, we're gonna revisit the stage Future Frenzy, so uh, let's do it! Hop in there, Crash. So we're gonna get those two gems that we couldn't get last time. Because basically, it deposited us in a secret hidden area with some crates in, in there, so uh, that's why I couldn't get all the crates, because a bunch of them were here. Uh, I gotta say, it's sort of the Crash 2 approach, and I mentioned this in Hang Em High, but it's not nearly as, oh, uh, like, kind of clever and elusive as it was in, Hang in uh, Crash 2. You know, in Crash 2, I mean, like, think about it here, what we're doing. In Crash 2, we went anywhere from jumping down pits to landing on uh, random platforms that just happened to be there to uh, stepping on fake nitro crates. And uh, think about it, in this, in this game all we're doing is uh, getting the time relics to unlock secret areas. Uh, I mean, I, 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 I guess I can see the whole... The secrets in Crash 2 might have been so secretive that you wouldn't have found them without the internet, which is a big hoax, considering I did find all of them without the internet. And, uh... You know, so... Let's make them a little easier to find in this game. Oh, wow, there, there's my first death. So busy talking about the internet, and, uh finding all the secrets and making it easier that I just plumbed it right off the edge. And, uh, this is post-commentary, too, so... Uh, what do you know? Anyway, I guess they wanted to make it a little bit uh, easier, considering, uh... You know, if you're trying to 100% the game, you don't want to make it, you know, darn near impossible to 100% the game, right? So I guess I can kind of see that. But it takes more of the fun out of it. It, it made it seem more like an accomplishment uh, in the first, in, or in Crash 2. Anyway, after all that rambling, there was a gem just there hanging out. So we grabbed it and we stepped on this secret platform, which takes us, oh, all the way back here. Well, that sucks. I'm going to have to do some backtracking. I've had enough of this backwards insanity. Backwards insanity. Backwards insanity. Oh! Lags. And missed it by that much. Man, his shoes came off. Alright, let's try it again. Thank you, I reloaded state. But I got fried again anyway, so what do you know? Let's not get fried. There we go. We didn't get fried. Sweet. Now, don't fall off the platform this time. Oh gosh, don't tell me it's gonna be a repeat of Ski Crazed. Okay, so let's try it again. You get out of here. Um. Uh, yeah. Got nothing to say right now. Make it this time. There you go. And I still got fried. It is like Ski Craze, isn't it? Oh my gosh. Yeah, I, I died quite a few times doing this. Just in this little itty bitty part, too. Yeah, you know what? You get out of here. This is when I suddenly realized, oh, you know what? I probably should be killing every enemy I encounter right here because I'm going to have to come back through this area. So I want to make sure the area is cleaned out. And I finally made it past the point where I kept dying. Yay! Progression. Yeah, so kill those guys. Kill everything you can. You, you you know, just to clean out the area. So that way it's nice and pristine when you come through. And I skipped the checkpoint. And there, there's that platform. And look, it takes us back. See, the one in Gone Tomorrow doesn't do that. This one does. For a very good reason. Now we gotta go backwards. Yay! Oh yeah, the bazooka does not work on those crates, uh, you know, which is... Makes sense, you know. 
bazooka's good, but it's not that good, you know. It takes the furry... The, it takes the power of furry belly to, to blow up or to destroy those crates, I guess. To break those crates. Save state, I think. Though that might actually be all of them. Oh no, there's more. Oh, right by a nitro crate. I think it's a life, if I'm not mistaken. Or it was a life, it's not anymore. Now it's a crate containing only one piece of bumper fruit. Which is disappointing, because if it was a life, that means it turned into a, a question mark crate. And when you get... There's something about getting one piece of wumpa fruit in a question mark crate, and it's very, very disappointing. It, you were expecting more, and then you get one piece. Uh, I don't know. At least that had a bunch of pieces. So did that. That one too? Yeah. Alright, now that's all the crates, right? Yeah, that's all the crates. When you see this downslope, you're good. You've passed your safe zone, but... Or you've, you know... You've made it... you made it all the way. You can turn around and head on back, which should be a piece of cake now. Because you've cleaned out everything. Except for that nitro crate. I don't know why you haven't cleaned it out. You got a bazooka, why not use it? Past 480, I'm talking to you. There's our platform waiting for us. There we go. Now, this time I will get the checkpoint. Just make sure you do get it. Because that would suck if you didn't get it. Because it counts as a crate, you see. And the rest of this we've already seen. Although, yeah, now we're coming into, from you know, now we're past, you know, now we're progressing. We haven't, well, I, I would say we haven't seen this. Of course, we have seen this. We've played this level before. Hey, you know what? We got a bonus stage that we haven't, oh, you know what? You took my freaking, uh, mask. That sucks. We got a bonus stage we haven't done before. So there you go. Yep, I left those pieces of Wumper Fruit just for you OCD people, like me. I think I was trying to see if shooting those platforms would do anything. Of course it doesn't. And bonus stage that I have not... I think I started to do it, but I didn't finish. I grew, I grew tired of it and I said, screw this noise. Although, if I'm not mistaken, we get to see some failures in here, too, don't we? Because everything was going good, and then here I just forgot to hit the spin button or something. I don't know what happened there, but that wasn't how you're supposed to do it. And then I kept failing after that. Watch, you'll see. I don't know why I double jumped, missed out on some lump of fruit. So, me being so brilliant, said, let me go back and get it, and then that happened. Oh, will it never end? Will the death toll continue to rise? Although I haven't lost any lives yet. Oofa! Now get it this time, you fuzzy little marsupial. There you go. Oh, I'm still gonna fail. I forgot to spam the spin button. I just sort of tapped it. You have to keep hitting it. It's funny, I make fun of uh, these signs posted to let you know which power-ups you're supposed to use, and I said, in case you're too dumb to figure it out. Evidently, I am, because, uh... <coughs> uh... <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, I don't like admitting that I'm wrong. As you can see, I get all choked up. I was saying, evidently, I was that dumb, because I didn't figure it out. They had it all lined up, spelled out, and mapped out for me, and I still failed. Many times, but now we got it. Uh, hey, you. Yeah, you. Die! There you go. Get 
Get out of here. Combo. Get that out of here. <clears throat> and the turbo shoot. Turbo shoot. Don't belly flop it this time. I can't believe that happened. Yeah. yeah right there. Perfect example. A, a, a question mark crate with a bunch of Wumpa fruit surrounding it. I was expecting so much more than one measly little piece. The great philosopher... Uh, you may know who he is, said, uh, getting ten cent, or getting, uh, an inch of snow is like getting ten cents in the laundry. In the laundry? In the lottery. Well, I chalk, uh, one piece of Wumpa Fruit and a question mark crate up to the same deal. But we did it! We got the gem! We got both gems of this stage! Yay! Future Frenzy is knocked out of the water! So, in the next video, we'll get some more relics. Until then, already bolts. See ya!